Hi, I'm Veronica Rowan, and I'm the 11th grade student of the month for January. How did I get here? I feel like um, my worth ethic was a big part of it. I'm, I was very focused last semester, and I'm trying to make the same transition this semester, seeing as I am in two AP classes, and the work is tremendous. Um, I try to set a good example for everyone around me, and I try to just be someone that everyone can just be happy around and try to be a positive person, try not to think negatively, and just work your, your, work your hardest. Another achievement is winning first place at ASPA, which is a competition for broadcast and yearbook. Um, I won first place in the editing category with um, a feature story I did about um, the band and everyone behind it. Some advice I would give to other students is focus on your schoolwork, but don't put your work before your mental health. Mental health is important. One fun fact about me is that I am a third degree black belt in Tang Sudo, which is a form of martial art. Um, I did it from when I was seven up until I was 17. Um, I was the second highest ranking female after my master who also owned the studio. And I have a twin, I feel like everyone knows that. We don't really look alike, but we're twins. Um, some of my hobbies include, number one, editing. I absolutely love editing. It's one of my favorite things to do. I love sitting in front of a computer. I'm burning my retinas with the brightness and working all night on a video. Um, I love doing picture edits. I love editing just feature stories and all that. It's just something I love. It's so satisfying when you finish. Um, I love reading. I love um, historical books. And I like watching two shows, Victoria and The Crown. They're really good if you're a history nerd like me. The future plans I have for senior year are getting through it, get the best grades I can, get my GPA up as much as I can. Um, and I actually have started looking at colleges. Um, my number one choice right now is the University of Alabama in Tuscaloosa. Um, they have amazing communications and journalism. Bye Clay Chapel.